I'm not sure whether insurance broking is a profession. Uh, there are people in it to exhibit professional behaviour. But to be a profession, we would have to, I think, come under uh, a body which could expel you and withdraw your right to trade. Generally, professionalism means uh, proper behaviour, proper market conduct, um, putting the client first, putting the market first, putting your company first, putting yourself second. Professionalism now with the Aldermanbury Declaration is the culmination of where our industry should really be. It's something that we've been striving for for a long time. Uh, finally, hopefully customers, clients will understand that the service that we give them is of a professional nature and we can only back that up with a professional standards. Professionalism is going to be when the client needs it most, getting the right cover, in the event of a claim, risk management, all of those issues which if you do not go to a, the right broker and you get the right professionalist uh, attitude, you're not going to get that service and that could mean the business a difference between your business staying open and your business closing, so I think for clients it's imperative. Brokers, uh, to the best of their ability, looking after their client. Um, brokers stand out from the other peddlers of insurance. Brokers are there to do their best for their clients, hold their hand and be there every time they've got a problem. And that's what brokers really do well. And that's why people should really use a broker. That's what professionalism is. Well, professionalism to me has always been the one thing. It's about doing what you say you're going to do, doing it the right way, the best way you can, and doing it when you say you're going to do it. And I think that's sadly lacking in the industry today in many places. I think the, the most important factor is all around treating customers fairly. And I think that's the biggest thing definitely that's come out of the FSA. A lot of brokers are scared of it. They should put their arms around it. And as long as the customer knows what they're getting and what they're paying for and are insured correctly, then you're doing your job professionally. It means putting the client at the heart of everything that you do, uh, keeping up to date with uh, professional development uh, and having uh, absolute in integrity in what you're doing. With recent uh, issues regarding uh, the banking industry, etc., people have gone back to a more face-to-face -face approach. So it's important that they completely trust the broker and I think uh, brokers are, are on a back foot really to get back to that situation where um, the ordinary customer in the street actually trusts the person um, who they're sitting face to face with. To us as a broker it means having our st t staff all trained. Everybody um, that's working at Corrigan's whether on general insurance or financial services are taking exams at some level. With all the regulations you need to have a certain mindset to, to deal with it. And it's no good coming from a shopping environment which you've got with direct sales people. I'll just come and tell you sales, there's a script. You've got to have a bit more about you than that, and we believe, and that's why we've signed up for the declaration. We believe it's going to improve our company, it's going to make everybody better, move us forward. You need to be able to rely upon somebody when they say they give you their word, you know you can rely upon it. Morality, profession, standards. Um, chartered status as a chartered firm. All of this is putting something back into the industry. Um, we, over the years we've probably been the, um, the losers because we haven't promoted professionalism and now we've got the adequate opportunity to do it. Moving forward um, we're starting to pick up business and, and have uh, relationships with solicitors and accountants who because of our standing and our status are seeing us in the same arena and the same ballpark as them. They feel that um, now we have the, the, the adequate um, professional standards to be taken more seriously than we've ever been in the past. Professionalism is knowing that you could refer a piece of business to anybody within the industry and you wouldn't be embarrassed by their performance.